Evening guys, Al here again, off on another adventure. So we are off to the mighty Chesil. Now the Exmouth Sea Angling Association Rover this month is the best two of each race species. So let's get down there, see if we can pull any out. Down on the spot there's a few tourists here so i just pulled out the uh, the spinning rod and i've just managed to get six mackerel so yeah we got bait for tonight fresh mackerel can't beat it but i want to get the rods in the water so let's get set up so short pulley pedal and a slab of that fresh mackerel let's get it put out one to show you why I was getting the mackerel on a little cotton candy there sidewinder metal 30 gram yeah did the trick I did 10 casts uh, pulled out six that's all we needed so yeah just stopped it there now I've got both rods out hopefully we can get some fish so I literally just put my second rod out been out about five minutes and into the first ray nothing big just a little one a couple of pounds and nicely get off the mark So Chris has got some scran on, already burnt them. Get on Chris, good lad. So second fish of the session, dogfish as always, but when it's dogfish there's race. Not what we wanted, let's get it put back. So I've just pulled in another doggy. Um, I've lost four fish. I've probably had nine or 10 bites. I'm not sure why I'm pulling into them and halfway in they're sort of spitting the hook. I've been using the uh, Sakuma 540 Stingers, size 30 with a chinu on the top, which I always use. But for some reason, yeah, I've lost four fish. So quite frustrating. But so far tonight, well, Tim and Chris haven't had any luck, but um, yeah, two doggies, a ray and six mackerel. So there's been a few fish pulled in, but um, yeah, change of rig, I think. I've checked the hooks, seem to be okay, a bit strange. So it's gone a bit quiet. May as well get a massive bait out. That is a chunk and a half. Let's get it chucked out. So just pulled into this beauty, little black bream, weighed in at one pound 15. Buzzing to get that, wasn't expecting that. That was on the uh, big mackerel strip. Happy days. So Chris has pulled into his first fish. Little ray there, two pound six. Happy to get off the mark. Well done, mate. Good lad. So Tim's first fish of the night. Lovely little ray. Happy to get off the mark. Good lad. Well done, mate. So Tim's just pulled into a pout in there. That's the sixth species of the night. And another little pouting, not what we want. Ah, Tim got caught in the act. Chris disappeared, so he tied a bit of line all the way to his reel. 
Ah, he's caught him, look. <laughs> Not what we wanted. Let's get it put back. So it's been quiet now for about the last hour. Uh, it's coming up to three in the morning and I've got work today. So we're going to call it end of session there. There we go guys, another session done. Turned out all right. Yeah, as I got there, straight onto the mackerel, uh, 10 casts, pulled in six, that's all we needed really. Um, and yeah, there was bites all night for me to be truthful. There was probably a lull of about an hour in between. But yeah, I lost a lot of fish, as I said, don't know how. But between us, we had six species. Now we all got the target species, all got small eyed ray, so happy with that. No biggies this time, unfortunately, however, Nice to get on the mark. So yeah, all good. I'm sure we'll be out again very soon. Big thank you to Chris and Tim, especially Chris for getting the food on and the brews. Well done, mate. Happy days. So yeah, we'll be out again soon. On to the next session. As always, guys, give us a like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't already and hit the notification bell so any adventures that we go on, you can come with us and we'll see you in the next session.